What's up, YouTube? Rudy El Segundo, and uh, I'm doing a little camping today. I'm doing some gear testing. This is my new tent, and uh, it's a pretty cool setup. I don't know if you've ever seen anything like this, but um, it connects to the back of an SUV, a pickup truck, or anything uh, of that sort. Uh, it's a five-person sleeper, and uh, it's got that sleeve that protrudes out, that juts out, uh, connects. You just strap it down, tether it down to your vehicle. Uh, be sure to keep that tailpipe on the on the outside of the tent. You don't want those fumes coming in and uh, those toxic fumes. Uh, you know what I'm saying. But uh, this is a nice setup, guys. We we got here pretty late last night. It's early April uh, 2013, and um, we're at Blackwell Campgrounds in uh, in Illinois. If you see this setup, though, you do need to be able to back up and have plenty of space where you can set up your tent. I mean, you could set it up on the gravel if you want to lay on the gravel, um, but I like a, a little plush uh, footing inside of my tent. Um, unless you bring carpets, you could carpet it, I guess. Um, rugs, whatnot. But it's a pretty cool setup. Um, it's from a company called Tex Sport, T E X S P O R T. And uh, let me just show you their logo. That's it right there. And um, like I said, I got here pretty late last night. I didn't really take a look at it. I, I ordered it online. I actually saw it at a Bass uh, Pro Shop some years back. And I saw it online, actually on eBay, a lot cheaper. I think I paid $114 with shipping. Uh, shipping was free. But it's a pretty cool setup, guys. If you guys have an SUV, it's, uh, it claims to fit. And that opening is very large. As you can see, I have a, 1500, a Chevy 1500 pickup truck. Um, that opening is a lot larger than most SUVs. But you are able to adjust it. It's got some straps down below where you uh, cinch it tight. Uh, I don't know if you see those straps hanging you uh you you can adjust it it's a lot wider um like i said it's a five person sleeper i have a mattress in the back of the flatbed and um i haven't set up completely i don't want to show you the insides yet it's pretty empty but it is spacious guys it's as you can see it's a lot wider than the truck it's a lot higher than the truck i would say it's about maybe six feet um, eight inches tall maybe maybe even seven foot I don't have the dimensions I'll note them on the uh, on the video but that's it man that's it's a good set it's a nice setup you guys might want to look into it tech sport eBay about hundred twenty dollars tops 120 that's it for me guys I'm Rudy El Segundo and I'm out